Republicans introduce a $700 million plan to keep the Brewers in Milwaukee through 2050. CBS 58's AJ Bayapur first reported on the details of this bill on Friday. He joins us live at American Family Field to break down how taxpayers would cover most of these upgrades. AJ. Natalie Jessup, good evening. Let's start with the very basics here. The state of Wisconsin actually owns American Family Field and leases it to the brewers. While the team's rent would go up under this bill, the vast majority of funding would be covered by the public. Some local leaders are now already suggesting changes they would like to see. Republican lawmakers roll out a plan Monday to put $600 million in public money toward upgrading and maintaining American Family Field through 2050. They say the alternative is worse, losing the team and income taxes from Major League ball players while being stuck with a vacant ballpark. If the team leaves, it is more expensive for the state. The $400 million coming from the state is tied to those income tax collections from brewers personnel and visiting players. As for local funding, the city of Milwaukee would be on the hook for $2.5 million a year. Milwaukee County would have to provide $5 million a year. $5 million a year is a lot. Our zoo is asking for $16 million for the rhino exhibit. Uh, transit safety and security is 3 or $4 million a year. Uh, the correctional officer pay is probably going to be near $10 million. For their part, the brewer's annual rent payment would go from $1.2 million a year to $3 million. Well, I understand the, the debate and discussions about the local contribution and the relevance of that, how much it's going to be. From our perspective, we're putting in a sizable amount of new money. We're asking just for the state to fund our landlord under an obligation that was made many years ago. One change some local leaders want is for the state to hand over some of the land. The Menominee River currently cuts through the stadium property. Supervisor Bergella says he would support taking some of the land along the river that is currently parking spots and convert it into real estate that the city and county can use to generate property and sales tax revenue that would help pay for its share of the renovations. It's a great part of Milwaukee County and the heart of Milwaukee County. And it's an opportunity that I think the state needs to really consider. The brewers, however, want to keep that idea on the bench. You know, could someday, you know, some development around the ballpark be a reality? Sure. Is that day coming anytime soon? No. I, I'm very um, protective of our tailgating culture. A sign that while there's a proposal, there's not necessarily enough of an agreement. The Brewers' lease here runs through 2030. However, there is urgency. The money raised by the longtime five-county sales tax is mostly drained, drained to the point where there is not enough money left in the stadium district to cover maintenance for another seven years. Reporting live tonight, outside American Family Field, A.J. Bayatpour, CBS 58 News.